Now to Georgia Representative Marjorie Taylor Greene tonight. She's apologizing for insensitive comments comparing coronavirus restrictions to the Holocaust. But she reportedly had a change of heart after a trip to the nation's capital. News Edge reporter Rob Darienzo explains. Representative Marjorie Taylor Greene made the series of comments comparing COVID mask restrictions and vaccination stickers to Nazi Germany last month. After initially standing by what she said, four weeks later, a rare apology from the Congresswoman. I know that words that I've stated were hurtful and, and for that I am very sorry. Those words coming hours after a group of lawmakers on Capitol Hill announced they intended to pass a resolution censuring her. The series of tweets and comments were criticized by both Democrats and Republicans. I believe that if we're going to lead, we need to be able to lead in a way where if we've messed up, it's very important for us to say we're sorry. Dove Wilker of the Atlanta chapter of the American Jewish Committee said Green's apology and visit to the Holocaust Museum were better late than never, but actions will speak louder than words. You know, it's important to see how she follows up on this. What type of language does she use? What type of rhetoric? What, you know, how does she influence her constituents, her followers? Green's comments came during an uptick of anti-Semitic attacks across the country amid the conflict in Palestine, an alarming trend that she's acknowledging. Over the past few weeks, we have seen Jewish Americans be attacked in our in our city streets and we've seen it on video. We've seen the reports and these are things that should never happen to any American. Wilker, who initially called the congresswoman's comments outrageous and frightening, what, hopes her apology represents the turning of a new so. leaf and that she will help be an advocate in the fight against anti-Semitism and will you know, cease using Holocaust and Nazi related uh, language when you know in the political sphere amid the controversial comments representative green has earned a lot of support on the far right in her first few months in office she raised a whopping 3.2 million dollars that's virtually unheard of for a freshman member of congress in atlanta rob Durienzo, fox 5 news